Dave Rutz, I'm here with Matt Centrowitz. Matt, you've uh, ran 335.26 this year, big win down in Cali, uh, 146 for 800. Yep. You've got to have great confidence uh, going into the trials in three weeks. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, things are starting to fall in place right now. Training's been going really well. I've been able to stay relatively healthy this year, which has kind of been my, my biggest downfall the last few years. So, um, you know, we still have three weeks to go to the first round. And at this point now, the work has been done. It's just kind of uh, connecting the pieces and, and kind of uh, more of a mental game at this point. Yeah. So the question of the day, if the Olympic trials would have happened in June of 2020, like they were scheduled, would you have been healthy enough to toe the line? We could play theoreticals here all day. If I would have won a million dollars yesterday, what would I be doing? I mean, I like to think I'm a gamer. Um, you know, if the trials were to happen last year, I would have uh, imagined myself ready to go on the starting line uh, and, yeah, ready to regain, retain my title and, and make another Olympic team. So um, I, don't, I don't like to play what ifs and, you know, all those things. Right now, uh, the facts are that we got the Olympic trials going in three weeks, and right now the Olympics are planned, and that's what my focus is on right now. Yeah. So a lot of injuries and niggles to deal with last summer and fall. When did you finally feel like you got healthy? How long has it been? I mean, I'm turning 32 this year. I don't know if I'll ever be healthy again. It's more just managing, uh, you know, the little hiccups that I end up having. But since January, pretty much since like last fall, I don't think I've been sidelined for more than like a week or two. And it's only been like two or three times that's happened. So honestly, in the last like two or three years, this has been the most healthy I've been uh, this past year. So obviously, you know, super fortunate and blessed right now to um, have things kind of clicking and, uh, um, yeah, like I said earlier, just kind of looking at it as more of a blessing that the trials are this year, not last year. And yeah, you, uh, in the one interview recently, you're, you're 31 and you kind of consider yourself, talked about yourself being as kind of a veteran of the sport. You've been in the sport for a hell of a long time. Um, how do you feel about the new breed of guys coming into the sport, the young guys coming out yeah. of college? Yeah, it's great. You know, um, it's always great when you have any type of young talent coming in, firing up the older guys. And I mean, it's just, it's just good for the sport, right? Having new faces and new competition fires me up. Um, it's been a while, I think. Uh, I was telling someone where I think a college guy has made a world or Olympic team in college. I think I was the last guy about a decade ago. So, you know, a uh, lot, lot can happen between now and the trials. And, and uh, I'm looking forward to mixing up with uh, not just college guys, but even high schoolers now. You know, we, we saw Hobbs run 334, and uh, it's an exciting time being a 1500 meter run in the U.S. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about the purpose of your workout tonight. Three yeah. 800s, uh, kind of back to back to back. Yeah. Um, were, were you supposed to like close hard the last 150, or did you have a race plan um, for each one? No, there wasn't. There wasn't any specific tactics for each race. It was just to to get some pretty much some 1500 meter. Um, I mean, th those low one. I think I averaged 151. That's like 1500 meter pace. So it was it was all for obviously more of a strength workout, um, speed endurance. Uh, workout for the 1500 uh, I ran a really good I, I was very pleased with my 800 last week I didn't feel like I needed to run any faster than 146 flat um, and so today was just about getting uh, a good hard effort in and uh, yeah I mean I'm, I'm very happy with where I'm at and and uh, you know I'm, I'm gonna draw a lot of confidence from today's work and um, yeah that, that rest is no joke <laughs> any more racing between now and the trials I don't think there's any opportunities I think this is pretty much it you know um, the 1500 is like the last event so I definitely wanted to come out here and, and give myself another hard effort before um, before pretty much all the racing is finished until after the trials. All right. Well, we wish you the best yeah. of luck at the trials. Great all job right, tonight. Thanks. Appreciate it.